Welcome everyone, I'm Marco Polignano from the University of Bari Aldo Moro, and I'm a researcher involved in the FAIR Project Spoke 6 Symbiotic AI. Today I'm going to present my work titled, A Study on the Identities of Large Language Models. Please feel free to contact me for more information. The thriving field of artificial intelligence has witnessed a paradigm shift with the emergence of large language models, LLMs. LLMs are characterized by their model size measured in the billions of parameters and their ability to learn and improve upon the tasks of language understanding and generation. This training process enables the models to learn the patterns and structures of a language in a more complete and efficient manner as they are not limited by the need for human-labeled data. The applications of LLMs are diverse and rapidly expanding with the potential to transform various areas and aspects of our lives. As an example, LLMs can be employed to develop chatbots that can understand and respond to a wide range of user inquiries. They can answer with a high degree of accuracy or to generate human-like article stories and entire books. Our work delves into the unexplored territory of LLMs and their interactions with system prompts, unveiling the previously undiscovered implications of system prompt-induced linguistic transmutation in Meta Llama 3 and Nita 8B model. Dissociative identity disorder, a complex and multifaceted mental health condition, is characterized by the presence of two or more distinct identities or personas within an individual often with varying levels of awareness and control. The advent of large language models has raised intriguing questions about the presence of such conditions in LLMs. Our research investigates the phenomenon of splits. The methodology used is straightforward. We load a reference large language model into memory using the Transformer Python library and a prompt is given as input. The responses are collected and studied for variations in personality, writing style ability, and accuracy of responses. We investigate three different research questions. Are LLMs affected by dissociative identity disorder? Has each identity owned skills and behaviors? Can we mitigate such problems? In order to ask the answers to RQ1 and RQ2, we design different system prompts, i.e. splits. We investigate different design varying from no system prompt to prompt where is explicitly asked to impersonate an historical or fictional character that I in the first scenario, we just ask, what's your name and what can you do? The results obtained from the experimental methodology show several quite surprising and unexpected results. We can observe that the model assumes a vague and ill-defined identity in the absence of a well-defined system prompt. In particular, although it identifies itself as an LLAMA model created by Meta AI, it does not fully know its functionality. Although the model is released as multilingual, it replies that it is not able to answer in Italian, even though it does this in answers for specific tasks. Two well-defined identities emerge instead in the case of the prompt Pirate and Mussolini showing well-related answers. Moving on to the questions concerning the capabilities of the different identities, we can observe that the answer given by the model without system prompts is incorrect reporting that Pulsinella is a character with a sad face. On the contrary, it commonly has a smiling face. The more distinct characters of Pirate and Mussolini answer with few details, highlighting the question's lack of consistency with the specific identity. As for mathematical skills, these seem to vary considerably according to the identity assumed. In fact, the results obtained, although all erroneous move between ranges of error that differ significantly from one another. Although in our ideal of a pirate identity as an uneducated subject in the answer provided through an intermediate reasoning step the result proposed is surprisingly close to that provided by a calculator. In order to explore possible mitigating strategies and answer RQ3, we evaluate different safe system prompts designed to reduce the split consequences. We observe that adding a simple system prompt like, you are an AI assistant without a specific identity. Do not impersonate any specific subject. Do not provide information, opinions, and suggestions on sensitive and dangerous topics. Can strongly constrain the model to have a positive and stable behavior. The findings of our study reveal a striking correlation between the system prompt and the emergence of distinct persona-like linguistic patterns in the LLM's responses. These patterns are not only reminiscent of the dissociative identities present in the original data, but also exhibit a level of coherence and consistency that is uncommon in typical LLM outputs. 
The exploration of this idea serves as a catalyst for the development of more sophisticated and responsible AI systems for a deeper understanding of human psychology and its complex manifestations in the digital age. Thank you for listening. Send me an email for any question.